good day guardian thank you so much for coming back to the channel if this is your first time finding a video that's pretty awesome appreciate you clicking on it so we all know trials can get super sweaty at uh six and seven uh wins but you can also get gatekeeped and that sucks that really freaking sucks um we can practice in elimination in the valor playlist right now in crucible and i found back in the day even in 6v6s i showed a lot more improvement when i would play my first game of the day i would record it i would critique myself on clips and engagements that i lost at or i just could have done a lot better at and I, I again some saw much more improvement than when i would just log on and then wonder what i could have done better so that's what this video is about that's what the next few videos or you know if it if people like these that's what it's going to be is just me going over clips of that match and being like this is what i would have done here this is what i shouldn't have done here you know i could have gotten a slayer medal here if i would have just instead of went to this corner went over here and threw a grenade you know so if you find yourself choking if you find yourself having problems with engagements and you want to figure out what you're doing wrong that's what i would do watch your game gameplay clips if you like what you see um here go ahead and hit that subscribe button leave a comment down below on what you struggle with and maybe i can try and make a video on practicing it and where you should practice and how to do it and how to learn it and you know ways to improve so um yeah go ahead and join me on this journey that'd be awesome uh but again hope you guys find this informative hope you're having a great day hope we're all learning something and as always eyes up guardian what up future mcgoogles here so i forgot to keep checking loadouts i played about two matches people just kept leaving or we just kept getting just absolutely smashed by a clan so i just figured that gameplay was terrible nothing i could do there couldn't really learn from it so this is the third match this is the one that i felt i did pretty well but there was a lot of things i could have done better because so i almost won v3 these guys um and i think the second round and then after that they just got super confident and started bagging and whatnot but um yeah i forgot to check loadouts they're all running about spare ration sniping so i started sniping with waking vigil revoker um and i'm gonna point out the clips that i could have done better and i hope you guys learn from it i know that i'm learning from it so um yeah hope you guys enjoy thanks for watching right there we should have pushed okay we should have pushed in instantly okay now we do a few things a few other things wrong i mean he got the pick we should have just instantly been like all right let's go boys just your mindset of elimination right so that's that's the first thing Okay, three things. One, I wasn't up here with my team, pushing with them, helping them, helping get the revives. You know, I am, I'm a warlock. I have a healing rift, that kind of thing. That would have helped us. Two, I have my sniper rifle out. I'm within hand cannon range, as you can tell. These two were using spare rations. They took these guys out pretty, fit, pretty quick. Um, and three, I was not in cover. I was strafing in the middle of open, just open field, no cover. Um, and as you can see, I just got absolutely obliterated, absolutely melted. So uh, that's the first time I died. That's the first time we all died. And that's my first few mess ups and our mess ups. So. so this next round, we actually didn't do too bad. We all stuck to cover pretty well. Uh, I could have done a little bit more, uh, a little faster with my revive. Could have helped a little bit more. I don't think I got a single kill. <laughs> but um, I did um, manage to revive one of my teammates and we did push them and put a decent amount of uh, stress on them to make them split up and try and flank us. So that let us separate them and then take them out one by one. So it was a pretty good round. I'm just going to let it play out. What? Oh. 
One minute left. All enemies down. Your team stands victorious. So this other uh, round, we actually won. We didn't do, do, do too bad. There was a few things I could have done maybe a little better, so I'm gonna let it play out and then I'll point them out as we go. Okay, so notice I took the shot at him, missed. We all kind of tried to take another shot at him, but we realized on our radars, okay, we're getting flanked, so we come around the, come around the corner here. All right, so I took the first guy out right here with the uh, headshot. Noticed, all right, I need to get to the high ground because I have people behind me. I need to get to cover, so I run up the hill to cover. Notice that this warlock and his buddy's gonna come around the corner, so I pull out my sniper, body shot the warlock, pull out my waking vigil, take him out with one shot, and then this guy, I notice is hiding, and I'm like, okay, so I gotta push. He's gonna try and do something, get the revive, do something, push us. So I put, push him with my grenade, my melee, take him out and get the Annihilation Medal. Alright, so this is the round that I almost 1v3 clutch it out. There were a few things I did wrong, like we should have pushed them when um, I took out this first snipe right here. And then when I get to the later part, you'll know what I did wrong. I'm gonna let it play out. Okay, push, push, push. Watch that body. One, my teammates should have backed up right there. Um, I could have rifted his body, but they should have just backed up. And we should have just kept watching his body, but his teammate went and got it. But um, that's just not how it went. I have no more special left. That's the problem. Okay, now as you can see, made space, separated them, right? Wrapped around, tried to get my teammates, but I knew if I went for them, would have died. Uh, took the first guy out with a grenade melee. Second guy out, three shots, you know, with my hand cannon. And then this third guy, I don't, I, in this moment right now, I don't know what I was thinking. I've rewatched it about eight times, and I still don't know why I went for the revive when I saw him on my radar. And you can see, just by my reaction, uh, I should have just tried to 1v1 him, and I'm really upset with myself, so here we go. Fuck! Okay, I'm ashamed of this, but I commit a cardinal sin, one, in elimination. Um, and then I commit another cardinal sin and elimination um one i waste my super and two i totally separate from my team and just get obliterated by a mind bender you'll see my reaction here we go Mindbenders, really? One minute. Mindbender, shotgun. 
Now it was pretty much, I mean, me wasting my super and then pushing into them without my teammates. That caused us the round because, I mean, they just isolated them and took them out one by one, you know, as you can see within five seconds of each other. So that was my bad. Shouldn't have pushed up, shouldn't have wasted my super, should have stuck with my team, stuck to cover. Just basically everything they, they tell you to do in, you know, elimination or 3v3s or anything competitive. This match, there was absolutely nothing to uh, go over. They pushed, I mean, my teammate overextended and they just pushed us hard. And they took my other teammate out with a shotgun and I tried to get to cover, but it was, they, they just pushed me to two. So it was, it was just a wipe. All right, so there are two things I should have done. We're gonna let the game play run out and I'll go over them. Okay, so they're about to start bagging me, um, but two things that I noticed in this. They popped two supers at the same time, and then right after popped another their Spectra Blades. We should have rotated and let those run out and then challenge them again 3v3. We didn't. Everybody tried to challenge. Uh, top tree Dawn Blades are a really hard shot to hit if they know what they're doing, right? Throw, dodge, dodge, throw, that kind of thing. Uh, and anyways, the Spectral would have cleaned this up on the ground. Now we should, yeah, again, we should have rotated, should have let the Supers run out, and then maybe clutch that round out. We would have had our Supers next round, clutch that round out 4v4, four four, you know, 4-4, four to four, and then maybe win the whole game mode. But that's just not how it went. I should have... Um, things that I learned, basically, in, in watching this gameplay. Stick to cover a little bit better. I need to hit my shots better. I am practicing in Kobats and stuff like that hit my shots better, and just stick with my team more. Pay attention to the radar, pay attention to my team, pay attention to what the enemy team is doing with their supers. That's why we have these little boxes in comp, you know, so you can see when they have their super, when they're using their super. There's so many sound cues in Destiny 2 that can help you with getting better at the game mode. So maybe turn up your headphones a little bit louder, you know, because you can hear footsteps better. You can hear the super from farther away, you know, when it's cast, that kind of thing. So. Um, I'm having a lot of fun doing these. I know it helps me learn. I hope you guys are learning. Hope you're finding this informative. I uh, hope everybody's having a great day. And as always, as a guardian.